Good afternoon, Ma'am Amelita. I am Roxanne Gates Canonoy from BSN Block 3. I will do emergency management for pull-up cylinder demonstration. So good afternoon, I am going to examine the emergency management for pull-ups of medical cord. First is I will gather all the materials needed in pull-ups of medical cord. These are the equipments we have for internal examination, assuming that these are the clean gloves. These are the lubricant for vaginal delivery. These are the two sterile gloves, one steak forceps, one mayor scissors, um, one urinary catheter, one placental basin, um, one needle holder, um, one uh, syringe with needles, uh, sterile OS, and cotton balls with betadine. And this, are the, this is the stethoscope. Good afternoon, ma'am. I am your nurse, Roxanne. Can you state your name? Ma'am, I will do internal examination to assess your progress of labor. This is to obtain client's cooperation. Ma'am, you will now be um, positioned into an examination table to, pro to check your progress of labor. of position to examine the internal examination for the patient. We have dorsal recumbent, sinks position, and knee chest position. Ma'am, I will now drape you and expose only the part I will assess. Taping the patient is to expose only the gynecological area of the patient. It is the way to respect the client's privacy. I already washed my hands and put examination gloves. After I assess or the uh, internal examination, I will change it into a sterile gloves. And this is the way to protect the healthcare provider in the gynecological diseases from the patient. Mom, I will now put my two fingers. Please take a deep breath while I examine your internal examination. Upon inspection, the cord may be visible at the vulva and the cord must check the pulsation. Mom, I will now assess the fetal heart rate of your baby. the well-being of the fetus, fetal heart rate too. And because cord prolapse is happening after after the rupture of membranes and when the fetal heart tone becomes low. Mom, I will now assist you in a new chest position. Please take a deep breath and do not bear down if you are to do so. Knee chest position is used to put out the gravity from fetus out of the pelvis. Mom, I will now insert the catheter in your bladder with sterile fluid. This will reduce the compression on your umbilical cord. This is elevating the presenting part by using the catheter, um, inserting the catheter into the bladder, and having a sterile fluid. Mom, I will now put my gloves hands into your vagina to put upward at the head of your baby. Please do not bear down if you have to urge to do so. 
Elevating the presenting part is to relieve the compression on umbilical cord. I will not remove my hands until we arrive in the operating room. Baby girl out, 2.30 p.m. If the newborn is having a good cry, I will go now in EINC. If not, I will cut the cord and proceed to resuscitation if needed. This is to facilitate the beating of the infant. After the procedure, I will now remove my gloves and wash again my hands. wash my hands. This is for infection control. Lastly, I will document the time, the date, and the procedures that I did. This is to provide accurate data in the care of the client. I'm all done. Thank you, ma'am.